After two years, the Mano experience is back, and more than 2,000 students are expected to attend. Dallas Ontiveros joins us live from campus with a preview. Morning, Dallas. Good morning, Christine Ross. Yes, it's taking place tomorrow from 10 to 2. You can learn how to register on our website at KH12.com. But here joining us on Wake Up Today, we have a special guest to tell us more details. This is Nikki Chun, who is a UH Manoa Vice Provo Provost <laughs> yeah. for Enrollment Management. Good sure. morning, Nikki. Good morning. Thanks Aloha. for joining us. Aloha. Thank you. Sure. So how are you feeling about tomorrow? I'm excited. Uh, there is definitely an energy already in the air. Our staff is um, spending most of today and through early tomorrow getting ready to welcome about 2,000 of our closest friends to And campus. that's going to be pretty amazing to see after two years. You know, we heard that there's going to be over 100 vendors here. Mm -hmm. There's going to be performances as yes. well. There's going to be music. It's going to be very lively here. But, of course, people want to get work done and also prepare <laughs> for what is to come for them. So you're not only going to see freshmen, but also maybe some returning students or transfers mm -hmm. as well. Yeah. Is it all the same route for them, or it's a little bit different? It's mostly the same route. And so for a role like mine, it's really just to make sure that students get from the beginning of their educational journey all the way to the end and so we want to be able to work with our students wherever they're starting and get them to where they'd like to end up in their college career. And I know there's been a lot of changes here on campus the last two years but how is the experience now? Is it pretty much how it was pre-pandemic? I think so. About maybe 80% of our classes in the fall plan to return in person. Um, this has been a wonderful learning experience for us to see what online learning could also look like as a part of this experience. Um, so we're excited to welcome everyone back from faculty to students starting the fall and we'll see where we go from there. And any advice that you could share with people who are maybe feeling a little bit nervous or maybe want a new start? A lot of people are looking for a new chapter after this pandemic. I mean UH Manoa offers everything from undergraduate degrees to graduate work, uh, certificate programs, um, basically anything somebody would want to find for their educational journey can be found here. And so I would say just come, come join us. Um, ask people in the offices, tell them what you're interested in, and let us see what we can do for you. Nikki, thank you so much for joining us here on Wake Up Today. You brought up a lot of points, and I know for myself, there's nothing like asking those questions and getting the work done in person. It's just so much easier for some of us, but if you want some more details on the Manoa experience taking place tomorrow from 10 to 2, and also how to register and what to expect, visit our website at khwin2.com. You can get the details there. Reporting out here at the scene, Dallas Navarro's KHWIN2 News, working for Hawaii. Thank you very much, Dallas. Exciting times on campus. Yep. More excitement because